That, that uh, happened to me throughout that I like today. So that's part of my creative process. I am trying to suck the viewer in any way I can. And my drawings are really about me interacting with the outside and uh, making the notes of what I'm doing, what happened to me, and then recording it either verbally or uh, figuratively on, on the paper. It's uh, a totally different experience when you see the final print and when you see the drawing, uh, you know, one fifth into the process, one half into the process, and when you fluctuate in between. When I draw on a computer, there are two levels that are different from uh, doing the drawing on the paper. One is obviously the technical part. Because when I draw on the paper, everything is determined beforehand and everything is into a sort of stable environment. The paper is same, it doesn't change. The pens that I have are always the same. There is an element of haphazard or fortuity in uh, in the way the, the pencils break, the, the um, watercolor spill and, and mix that I cannot control. Now that can be uh, totally reversed in uh, digital drawing and of course that's only a technical aspect but uh, it, it has a incredible uh, um, ramifications for the process. For me when I don't like something I can just uh, um, reverse the whole process. However, this creates a whole another level for uh, the viewer to see that. Because when I do remove, overpaint, erase something on my drawing on a paper, that becomes, uh, that becomes non-existence for a viewer. When I do that uh, on a digital drawing, that is being replayed next to it or in the vicinity and immediately uh, the viewer is uh, is exposed to what I took away or took out or what was there before. This is supposed to create for a viewer another dimension. Compare. It's a really comparative analysis where you look at the drawing the way it was uh, conceived and the final product. You can compare them. Based on that, you can actually come to a much greater understanding or uh, empathy with my uh, uh, with my work. So I realized that I can break the digital drawing into uh, scripts. I can record scripts the same way the chapters and pages are written in the book. And my drawings are like a book anyway, because they are, uh, they are fragmentation of different uh, occurrences, happenings. It's a map, geographical or, or orthographical um, of a record of a certain period of time. I think it's a legitimate way to uh, expand the force of the impact that, that uh, my drawings should have.